Hey everyone, it's Susie again. Here is another video. I told you this is just going to be a marathon this weekend. Um, I have so many things that I'm working on and have made and want to uh, post uh, for sale and things that um, this is just a great weekend to do it. I've had four days off, or will have four days off. It's off yesterday, and of course I got uh, the three three more to go today and then uh, Sunday and Monday. So anyway, these are some of the cutest little books. I have these bags. I don't even know uh, where I got these bags. They've just been in my stash for so long. Uh, but they do measure about a four by three. So a uh, three by four, four by three. But anyway, they are adorable. And of course, they were inspired by the adorable paper bags, which I am working on some more. Uh, this is going to be a wedding one. Uh, I'm going to be working on these this evening, and I'll have a video of them probably uh, tomorrow sometime or Monday. And um, I also will be doing the Parisian Cafe, at least part one of that tutorial, and also the tutorial on making the adorable paper bag. So that's something that I'm going to be posting in the next couple of days. So anyway, these here are the cutest little, little bags. Ugh, they're just adorable. Um, of course, I have named each one because I am going to have them posted on my blog. Uh, this is Mama and Mabel Micro Mini. And, uh, of course, the images did come from Pinterest. This I do have just my uh, seam binding that I have copy dyed. And then, um, of course, each one will have this little piece of coffee stained paper for you to journal. I think it's a really cool idea if you idea if you would um, just uh, date your book or you know maybe write what is in your album here in your little bag album uh, on that piece of paper and it's right in the front and it, you know you can always tie it shut and if you can't remember then pull it out and you'll know what's in your what was in your album. But here is a really cute image, and then of course my little um, place for journaling there. Here is just a piece of note paper, another little piece of note paper. Everything is coffee dyed. Here is some pretty little sewn on crocheted lace. Everything is copy dyed and uh, sounds so good when you turn the pages. I love the sound of that crinkle. These are some paper bags that I just uh, copy uh, stained and baked. There's a little image that's stitched around. Piece of parchment. And I hope I'm not getting out of frame. I, I, uh, yeah. I did a video yesterday, but I was out of frame when I went to uh, run it through the iMovie. It was out of frame, so I had to just kind of ditch it and start again. But here is a little piece of stained paper. This is a really pretty pale pink uh, fabric. Here's some sari ribbon. And then here is just a little... A little booklet here out of the paper bag that I had coffee stained. A little belly band out of the crocheted lace. One big page. Here is another little, kind of like a little booklet there for journaling. A little tuck spot. Here are the little images. There's another piece of the belly band here. Just a little booklet there with some. Um, seam binding, coffee stained seam binding. Here is some little lace sewn on the edge of the page there. Here is another little journaling spot, a little image. Now this is a mother-daughter themed one. Every picture has a mother and a daughter. There's a mother and a daughter. Now this is just stitched on, not a pocket or nothing. But and here are my little flips. I like to kind of tuck them back and stitch them down on the ledger paper. Another little tab there with lace. This kind of tucks in the... Another mother-daughter. How cute is that image? And then here is 
a little pull out there to journal on. Now this is the little, my little uh, Mama and Mabel micro mini. That's what I named these was just micro minis. They were so cute and small. Okay, then I have this one which um, is uh, Millie. This is my Millie micro mini. And this here is just some sorry ribbon. Of course the, whoops, I'm trying to get in there. Of course the uh, little paper there on the little inside of the bag cover is there. And then you open it up and here are just some more pretty images from Pinterest. Another little journaling booklet. My um, coffee stained paper, some ledger paper. Here is another little place for journaling. Here's some really pretty ribbon. I actually got this at uh, Hobby Lobby, this pink and green. Isn't that beautiful? I love that. Little tuck spot there. And a little cute image. Some more sorry ribbon. This does pull out. This is some really pretty little shabby chic colored uh, rosettes that I got from Hobby Lobby. Another just pretty little image on a, I've just stitched it down on the page there. A piece of parchment. Here is some really pretty lace. I, I can't even remember where I got this. I probably got it at uh, Hobby Lobby. But how gorgeous is that? Oh, love it. It's like little flowers is what it is. I can see the rose petals or the leaf petals there. How pretty is that? Here's some more of that pink pink and green. Another little booklet. Tucks in the little spot there. These are just, just like my adorable minis that I made, only just smaller. Here, this is a really pretty, this is kind of almost an elastic -y lace there, and it's really pretty. Tucks in the page. Piece of that really pale pink fabric. And then here is a little belly, well, it's not really a belly band, it's just a little band there going up and down, a little piece, place for journaling there. And, of course, my paper. Here's some, oh, you know what? I got that at Walmart. That green, I got at Walmart, because this I got at Walmart, too. And I think I got it at Walmart. How pretty is that? Oh, I love it. Um, and then here is another little a little uh, journaling place tag and anyway here's the here's the back but anyway this is my Millie micro mini and then here I have um, she is Sadie this is my Sadie micro mini and she's got the coffee stained seam binding to tie closed Paper on the inside, of course, to journal on. She is really cute. She's got pink, like a pink bonnet on with some pink and white uh, daisies or something. They're just gorgeous. And then she's got some daisies in her hair in this image. And here is just a little journaling paper bag booklet that's in that little belly band. Another piece of paper just for journaling. Here's some more of that. This is really a pretty crocheted lace and this I did get at Hobby Lobby there. Parchment paper. There's another little, just a little booklet. Another little pretty image sewed on. Some more of that really pretty like flower lace. Another little booklet here. Pretty image. And then here is some more uh, journaling paper. Another belly band with just another piece of paper bag journaling tag. And then here's another little booklet to 
to journal. And anyway, this is my Sadie Micro Mini. Aren't those cute? Oh gosh. Okay, then with Graphic 45, I uh, I made a little booklet after I had made the Traveler's uh, Size Notebooks uh, journals. Um, I used some of this paper to make a paper, uh, portrait of a lady micro mini here. I did use the sorry silk ribbon here. And then I just cut these out of the 12 by 12 uh, tag sheet there in the book. So this here was one of the round. I just simply cut her out and then stitched around her. And then on the inside, these images are just so pretty. There's a pretty little uh, lady here in a frame. And of course my little tag, journaling tag there. And then of course I have sewed on some of the papers there. Here's a little rosette that is absolutely beautiful. I got this from Hobby Lobby. Stitched around the page there. Here's another little image of a round picture I've just stitched around. Here is some of that fabric or uh, ribbon. This I got at Walmart when I got the green and the and the uh, other color there, that pink and green pretty color. Here's some lace I've just stitched on a book page. Here is just that old time Tim Holtz uh, paper clip, and I've just clipped that little image there on it. A little tip it out of a parchment paper. Here's a little belly band off this book page and I have just a little journaling spot there and then just a little picture there in that paper pretty and it sits in the band there and then here is a couple of little tags this one says hello beautiful place for journaling on the back and then a little piece of journaling paper there here is a little tuck slot up oh, which I think is where this probably went all right, I thought that was kind of odd that I would have had two sitting in there, but there we go. That's where that one belongs, in that little pocket there. Another little pretty image I've just stitched on. And I've left every tail long on these little albums. They're just so cute with those tails. And then here's another one of the rosettes I've just uh, sewn on the sheet of uh, paper there. Another little journaling spot there. And anyway, there is my little portrait of a lady micro mini. So anyway, like I said, I am going to have these posted on my, uh, on my blog also for sale. So anyway, thank you so much for watching.